Hey everyone, after last week's uh, successful trip to Tunstall, I've come back today. Uh, there's been a lot of heavy rain this week, so that should have washed a lot out of the cliffs. There's been some high tides and a lot of wind as well, so um, hopefully there'll be some good stuff out there. Uh, I only got halfway down the beach last time I was here because there was so much to look through. So uh, I'm looking forward to getting to the other half. And uh, yeah, let's see if we can find some good stuff. Catch you later. Here we go, so this is perfect. There's all this to look through. Didn't get that bit, wasn't there last time? It's all down there. Looks like there's a few people out having a look, but hopefully they've uh, missed a lot of this stuff and I'll head down that way, see what we can find. I mean, this is as good as it gets. All the sand is gone, and it's just pure pebbles everywhere. something buried in the clay here it's got some keels on it so I'm gonna get it out and see how much of it is there unfortunately it was only this much to leave that there so I found this one you can just see what looks to be a keel sticking out so I'll give it a hit and see what's in there okay so it does seem to be packed with stuff in there some of the bits that have come away there's Definite ammonites, shells in there. So we'll uh, we'll take it back as it is. See what it looks like when it's prepped. Just found this part segment of an ammonite. It's very nice. And on this side, a nice white calcite. Nice. Just come across this, what looks like a big bit of chip. So you've seen that pattern. This has got an interesting shape to it. If I turn it over, almost get the impression that there might be an ammonite sticking out of that. So let's give it a whack. Oh, no, there isn't. Let's see, is there anything in it? From past experience, there probably isn't, but let's hope that this will be the first one. Here we go. Thank you. 